I yes. literally mem remember standing in the pantry, just, you know, I'm eating almonds because, you know, almonds are supposed to be healthy for you, <laughs> but not a bucket of them. <laughs> right. <laughs> so I'm saying, though, a lot of people can't name whatever it is, whatever is the story they're telling themselves, because they're kind of unconsciously doing it. Yes, but if you ask yourself, so if you're eating unconsciously, chances are there's a ghost child there. That's what I'm saying. If it's me that's eating a bucket of almonds, then I can pretty much bet that something got triggered in me that I wasn't aware of when Absolutely. it got triggered. Yeah. So she or some part of you want something and it might just want a moment to sit down and just find out what got triggered. What happened there? Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. I've what been in happened? that. I've been in that. Yeah. Okay. So set your intention to heal means knowing that whenever that thing gets triggered, hey, hey, just having an aha, whenever that thing gets triggered, that's really a holy moment for you. That's right. That's a holy moment that you get to, you get yet another chance. Yes, to exactly. To fix this thing. Yes, that is the holy moment. That's why it's a doorway. That's why food is the doorway, because yes. when you want to eat and you're not hungry, you have the chance, yet another chance, to say, oh, if my purpose of really, when you know what your intention is, which is to show up in this life, while you're still here on earth, that's the other thing that showing up in the body does, landing in your body, you get to show up on earth while you're still here. You don't get to miss your life. Yeah. That's our number one intention. And if you're eating, if my thing is ice cream. If I'm eating ice cream when I'm not hungry, I'm not doing that. Okay. That's why it's helpful to remind myself that my intention is to show up completely. Well, this friend of mine sent me this delicious ice cream. So I, was, I sent him a note uh, to thank him over the holiday saying thank you for sending ice cream. And he goes, but uh, he goes, I didn't know you were doing the Weight Watchers thing. Can you still eat ice cream. I said, I can eat anything I want. I cannot eat the whole carton. <laughs> I eat it slowly, intentionally, and deliberately. Uh. And I enjoy every spoonful until I no longer feel that sensation of pleasure. Yes, fabulous. Isn't it? Because mo when you eat compulsively or emotionally, you're missing the taste of food. Yeah. I would agree with that. You're doing it to assuage the loneliness or whatever got triggered, but you're doing it for that. No, you're doing it to fill the hole. Yes, to fill that hole. Hi, YouTubers. I'm excited to give you an update about our own YouTube channel. Now you can find new videos every day. They're the kind of videos that will make you look at life differently. They may even make you laugh a little bit. Subscribe to the own channel today, and we'll see you on YouTube.